right, good morning everyone. We are here in Kichijoji today and we are going to a Capybara Cafe in the evening. But first we're gonna walk around, go to some cafes, see what's up.
is possible. I'm fair. You chose me. No, oh, I'm fair. Look at my new cup. Isn't it cute? It's this, it's like Stanley and Starbucks collab from their new Sakura collection. Really cute. Anyway, I realized I don't think I've sat down with the camera yet. So this morning I was a Pilates princess and then I went shopping a little, even though I shouldn't have, I did. So I ended up getting the blue, it's like a wrap skirt. So yeah, sorry, it's, it's like undone. I was thinking about getting the black, but I think I always go for black, so I'm gonna try to branch out. And this actually fits really nice. I might also get the black if I really like this. Uh, I feel like Gap has slept on, partly by me. <laughs> when I was in college, Gap was like really lame, high school, college. But now in Japan, I think it's um a bit cooler, <laughs> I guess. I see a lot of people wearing the Gap, like the hoodie thing here, you know? I really need to go to Gap more because um, A, their sizes are good. Like, I don't, I guess they're actually American sizes because I tried on the large and it was like quite big. So I got the medium, which is, I never do. And I also have a down jacket from Gap and that's also a medium, but actually I probably should have got the small in it. It's kind of too big. I don't know, their sizes are crazy. Like the Japan Gaps, most of the things they carry are extra small or extra, extra small. Anyways, Gap. Good. And then I went to Plaza and got some skincare stuff. This is my favorite morning mask kind of thing. Like it's a mask, but you only wear it for like 30 seconds a minute. And it's like, it's how I wash my face. And it's kind of like toner and stuff. I really like it, especially this green one. It has like Sika in it or whatever. And then I spent a lot of money on this brand. How do you say it? La Roche Posay. I don't know. So I got some of the lotion or it's called lotion. I don't know if is it actually lotion or is it toner? Japanese skincare words are confusing. And then I got the face wash. In America, I could get this double sized for the same price or cheaper, no cheaper. Uh, this was like 20 something. This was also 20 something, I think, or more. Wait, I don't know. They're about 30 bucks each, which is a lot, but we're gonna try it. And yeah, now I'm at home. It is the afternoon, so I think Things are gonna be changing here soon in my life. And that also means for the channel, I'm not committing to anything. I'm not saying anything yet. Um, I probably will later, cause I don't know yet. But basically I'm gonna be graduating in two weeks. <laughs> so that means I have to work for a living <laughs> like everyone else. So I got a job, but that means <laughs> I'm gonna be way busier than I have been. That was the best part of grad school. I mean, I wasn't as busy 
first of all, and then all this flexible time so I could do what I wanted, kind of, when I wanted. But time to go back to reality. <laughs> um, actually, I'm kind of excited to work again. Honestly, this past semester, I felt very, like, I'm done with school. Like, I really want to do something different, like, challenge myself more in a different way. I'm really excited about the job I got, actually. I'm really excited. <laughs> Please don't ask me exactly what I'm doing or where. I don't want to share it yet, but if I decide to eventually, I will do it on my own accord, so please wait. I'll share a bit, a little bit more about it later after I start, but not not now. But um, it's not teaching. I know that's mainly what people want to know. No, it's not teaching at all. No children, just adults. <laughs> I will kind of miss teaching though, because I don't know, kids are really cute. Actually, I think one of the good things about a Kiowa compared to ALT work is that at my Kiowa, we teach like classes. It's not one-on-one, -on -one, but the classes are quite small. They're like under 10 kids. So that means I actually know all the kids really well. You know, their names, their personalities, etc. And I really connected with a lot of them. Well, when I was in ALT, it was way harder, way too many kids, you know, like just a few kids I really only knew. So that's one of the good parts of it. I don't know. Maybe I'll make a video in the future comparing everything because now I've done over two years in each ALT and a Kiowa. So let me know if you're interested in that kind of video. I don't know. At the same time, I'm ready to move on from teaching. I don't want to be a teacher my whole life. It's not for me, I don't think. But it was fun for while well, I did it. But I'm ready to become corporate Allison. No suits though, so thank god. So yeah, things are going to be changing. My life's going to change. Um, I don't know exactly when I'm going to be starting the job because you have to change the visa. Right now I'm in Japan on a student visa, so I have to change it. And that's probably going to take about a month. So I'm probably going to be starting like end of April or even May at this rate. Because I, I haven't, uh, we haven't started the process yet, but that's fine. I don't, I don't really mind when I start. But once I start, probably gonna have to reduce the number of videos on the channel, maybe to two a month from what I do now for a month, you know, once a week to once every two weeks, just at least at the beginning. So I am gonna have to commute an hour each way. So I'm not really gonna have much time. And also in Japan, especially at like entry-ish level jobs, you work eight hours and then you also have a one hour lunch break. So the work day is like nine hours long. That's how it is. How is it in your country? Let me know, I'm interested. But yeah. Things are happening. We're making moves. <laughs> also, my family is coming to visit in less than two weeks now. So I'm gonna be busy also with that. Don't know about the videos, we'll see. I don't know how much I'm gonna film with them, if at all, we'll see. I don't know. Okay, I'm going to clean the apartment a little bit. was taking a TikTok break and I got a package. I ordered a trench coat from Honey's last year and the year before that too. I really wanted a trench coat, but like I didn't wanna, I don't know, I didn't wanna buy it because they're kind of expensive. And I didn't find one that I loved that like fit me in a way I wanted to. So I've just wanted one for two years. And then I went to Honey's the other day and I tried one on and I thought, you know what? This one's good, this one's fine because I can't just keep waiting. Uh, so I tried on at Honey's, but the, they only had like one left in the double L size, which is what I got. But that one they had had like a little, like a pen mark on it or something. So I was like, I'll just buy it online. And I did and it was $2 cheaper. So budgeting queen. <laughs> Everyone needs a trench, especially in Tokyo. Basically every girl here has a trench coat. And this one is water repellent. Can you see it? I don't know. Yeah, I think it looks good. So you can do it like buttoned or a lot of girls here, like they'll tie this in the back into a bow. So yeah, now I have a trench coat ready for spring. Well, I guess it's here kind of, but mm. okay. I think I'm gonna end the vlog here today because I've talked a lot and my memory card only has three minutes left on it. Ooh. Got a message. So thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Make sure you like the video to support me and leave a comment down below and subscribe to my channel for more content about my life here in Japan in the future. I'll see you guys back here again next week as always. Bye.